Hi everyone, I'm Cheryl, physiotherapist at Fitterfly. So starting a regular moderate intensity exercise routine can help in managing obesity which leads to improving your body's response to insulin. This will further help in controlling your blood sugar levels. Additionally, practicing some muscle building exercises will also help improve your endurance, strength and reduce your blood sugar levels. Therefore, also decreasing the medications you need to control your sugar levels. To get these benefits, a balanced exercise routine should include cardio or aerobic training, strength or resistance training. When you do any form of cardio exercise, such as walking, running, swimming, cycling or jogging, you are also strengthening your heart muscles. When this is combined with strength or resistance training, you have the perfect recipe to improve your insulin sensitivity and your blood sugar levels. And that is why managing your diabetes and exercise go hand in hand. Cardio exercises help in burning extra calories effectively and strength training uses external weights to strengthen your muscles. Ideally, it is important to put in at least 150 minutes of cardio in a week. Strength training should be done 2 to 3 days a week and should last for 30 to 45 minutes in order to achieve your goals of managing your blood sugar levels and weight. So, exercising will not only support you to control your sugar fluctuations but also help you achieve your weight loss goals. If you have any such diabetes or weight loss related concerns, then please do write to us in the comments below and we will try to help you with the best expert advice. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe if you are new to this channel.